In the beginning, to preserve his life, she administers a potent medicine, which was against the rules. The people who had been affected by the smoke, understand that there was an acid in that smoke. Begin, so, it is being informed at the start, that due to the use of dangerous chemical weapons, the earth was not able for humans to survive or breathe. That's why the survivors were making a big space station, in the sky and living their lives. Its name was Ark. These people had made it so good, that they were living their lives very comfortably. The people have been living on Ark for 97 years. Now, the scientists of Ark finds out, that they have very little oxygen left. With which they will be able to live only for 6 months. The rules for living on Ark were made. If anyone made a mistake or did not follow the rules, then that one was thrown into the open sky as a punishment. The punishment for throwing out of Ark was given only to those, who were more than 18 years old. And if people under the age of 18 make a mistake, then they were also locked in jail. And here only one child was allowed to be born, so that the population does not increase. And now due to the lack of oxygen, the government decides that we will send the prisoners on the ground. To find whether or not the earth is capable of supporting life. And even if the prisoners die there, then there will be no loss because they are all criminals. And if the ground is fine, then it is a matter of joy. Because these people will live there without any trouble. Food, water, oxygen, there will be no shortage of anything. But if this does not happen, then after six months, their arc will also end forever. So now everyone agrees to send the prisoners to the ground to save humanity. A bracelet is worn on the hands of all the prisoners, so that the people of Ark can see how long they can live, and keep an eye on them. A radio is also installed in their spaceship to communicate with them. And that's it. With this, they are sent to the ground. In Ark, everyone rich, poor, small, and big are treated the same way. Everyone will be punished, no matter who the criminal is. In the prisoners, the son of the head of Ark, and the daughter of the most capable doctor, Clark was also included. Clark's dad was also thrown into space, who was a scientist. He first found out that the people of Ark have less time. Before the oxygen runs out, they should be thrown into space, who are tired of their lives. And this should be known to everyone. But Ark's government did not listen to him. Kept this secret so that people do not get worried. But when Clark's dad refused to believe this, he was thrown into space. On the screen of the prisoners' spaceship, Ark's head comes and tells them that as soon as you reach the ground, go to the army camp. Because you can save yourself there. Everyone listens to him very carefully, but does not take it seriously. Because no one liked the head. Because of his strict principles. Then a boy who was the companion of Clark, opens his belt and flies in the air. Clark was stopping him to do this, but he did not listen. Seeing him, two more prisoners do this. But when the spaceship turned a little, they fell very badly after being hit. And they died, which everyone feels very bad to see. After reaching the ground, they see that the environment has become absolutely fine. You can breathe here and life is possible there. Octavia comes out of the ship first, who is the guard's sister. And their mom was also thrown into space. Because she did not follow the principle of giving birth to a child, she gave birth to a second daughter. Everyone was very happy to come to the ground. Because now they were free. Ark's people were not able to contact the prisoners. Because all their devices were damaged. Just with the help of a bracelet, it was being found that everyone except the two were alive. They do not know how they died. Because of this, the Ark officer says, that I think the ground is still not worthy of living. That's why they both died. And now to save their lives, some people should be thrown into space. So that oxygen is used as little as possible. According to which the doctor here, Clark's mother tells him that we should be a little more patient. They must have died for some other reason. Because if it was because of the earth, then everyone would have died. That's why it is known that before leaving, a prisoner had shot the head. That's why now his condition is very bad. The doctor came to see him quickly. She uses a lot of medicine to save his life, which was against the Ark principle. So she was also imprisoned for the punishment. And the decision to throw her in space is made. But the next day, when she started being punished, the head came there to save her life. Says don't do this. Because if you do this, we will lose our worthy doctor. They argued about this. But the doctor's punishment is forgiven. On the other hand, the Clark and the head's son, were looking at the map to find the army camp. But Clark does not talk to him much. Now they both tell everyone to find the army camp. But Octavia's brother, guard, refuses to do this. No, we are happy in this way. And we will not even contact the people of Ark. Because there they treated us badly by making us prisoners. And if they also come to the ground, they will make our life hell. But the head's son explains that don't be stubborn. 
It is necessary to find the camp. Now they had to cross the river and go to the other side. Through the long tree. First of all, the Clark's friend is this. As soon as he reaches the other side, he gets a boat. Which he was very happy to pick up. Because the army camp was nearby. Before this, they do something. Clark's friend was attacked, and someone tried to kill him. Seeing this, everyone got scared. They do not understand anything that who must have attacked. There the guard tells his prisoners that through this bracelet, the people of Ark are keeping an eye on us. When they find out that the condition of the earth is good, they will come here and imprison us again. So immediately remove this bracelet, so that everyone on Ark feels that the prisoners are dead. The earth is not good. Everyone agrees with him, because they did not want the life of prisoners like before. They remove their bracelets and destroy them. The people of Ark really feel that all the prisoners are dead. So in the meeting of the seniors, it is decided that about 209 people should be thrown into space to save oxygen, so that the rest can be saved. Hearing this, the doctor refuses to do this. She says to find some other way. She asks for 10 days. But she was told that there is not much time. If she does not make a decision now, then 320 people will have to be thrown into space. But still she does not lose hope. Once the meeting has concluded, she meets a mechanic. Secretly, she was saying to repair a spaceship, so that she herself goes to the ground. And by contacting from there, she can tell the people of Ark about the environment there. Hearing this, the mechanic also decides to go to the ground with her. Clark tells everyone that we have been attacked by a companion. He is injured, and along with Clark, everyone goes to take their injured companion. But there was no one there, looking at the signs of the blood. When they go ahead, they meet their companion, but in a very bad condition while hanging with a tree. As soon as Clark came forward to help him, she falls into a big pit, which was a kind of trap, by which everyone understood that there is someone here who wants to catch people and kill them. As soon as Clark was pulled out, an animal comes and attacks them, but then the son of the head shoots him and kills him. They take the injured companion down, and they take him with them. Clark sees that someone has made a medicine of a plant, and applied it to him and tried to cure him. So now she also goes with her companions. She goes to take the plant, so that the injured companion can be cured as soon as possible. She got the plant, but then suddenly she hears a terrible voice. Along with that, a very big yellow smoke storm comes. Seeing this, all the heroes got very scared. To save their life, they get into an old car. But there was less space. So the rest of the people ran here and there to hide. But they get caught. Then after everything becomes normal, Clark comes out with her companions, and sees that whoever get caught in the smoke, they understand that there was an acid in that smoke. Clark also takes off her bracelet, so that her mom thinks that she is dead. And when the doctor sees this on the screen, she is very worried. She tells the mechanic to fix the spaceship as soon as possible. But a woman listens to their conversation, and she went and told the government of Ark about this. Because of this, they come and arrest the doctor. Then the mechanic leaves her alone and goes towards the ground. Because they had decided, that in the case of an emergency, the mechanic will go to the ground alone. And when she reaches there, she tells the doctor about the situation. Clark treats the injured companion with her companions. He starts getting better. When the head's son was sitting alone outside, a girl comes and kills him. Because she wanted to take revenge for her mom and dad. That girl tells the truth. That I have killed him. And the guard's companion wanted to kill the girl. But the guard saves her life. Because she was very small. But later that girl kills herself. Clark and Finn start liking each other. When they were looking at the stars in the sky at night. They also start looking at the spaceship. In which the mechanic was coming. Then Clark and Finn also come here. As soon as the mechanic sees Finn. She hugs him. Because he was her friend. The reason she descended to the ground. Seeing this. Clark becomes sad. Because she started loving Finn. The next day. The guard comes to see the spaceship secretly and disconnects its radio and throws it in the water, so that no one can contact the Ark. Now the mechanic tells the people of the Ark, if it is not told that the environment on the ground has improved, then the government there will kill 320 people. So now people start running towards the ship, so that they can inform the people of the Ark. But when they find the radio disappeared, then they got very nervous and start looking everywhere. When Clark and the mechanic see the guard here, they understood that this is the action of him. The mechanic threatens him, on which he tells the truth, that yes, I took out the radio, and I did this because before coming to the ground, I had shot the head, because of which I was afraid, that if those people come to the ground, then my death is certain, 
the mechanic tells him that the doctor had saved the head. And now you will tell where the radio is. When the guard was satisfied that I am completely safe. Then he tells but when she takes out the radio. Then because of the water, it was damaged. Then the mechanic came to the camp with the radio and some other people. And without wasting time, she starts to repair the radio. In the ark, the doctor very cleverly plays her husband's video there. By which everyone had come to know. That the government has done a lot of such things. By which their lives can be in danger. But instead of getting angry, come to Ark's government and say, that we should be pushed into space. So that the lives of others can be saved. Seeing this, all the government officers are saddened by their mistake. Even unwillingly, 320 people are locked in a very big room. And oxygen is stopped. They are immediately thrown into space. Seeing this, on the ground, the prisoners are very saddened by their death. Because no one knew, whose family is left or whose is not. But the next morning Octavia, when she was going through the jungle, she falls down and got injured a lot. Then a man, who was already living on the ground, he picks her up and takes her with him. Actually with this man, there were other people too who were his companions. When the condition of the ground deteriorated, then these people hid and somehow saved themselves. After which they became hunters. And these were the people, who were catching the prisoners. The rest of the people started looking for Octavia. After a lot of hard work, they found her. Along with her the hunter as well, whom these people catch. Because they were thinking, that this man has kept Octavia with him to kill her. Although Octavia explains to them, that he saved my life, and he is a good man. But no one listens to her, and they begin to kill the hunter. By getting a chance, the hunter kills Fink with a poisonous knife. Which made him unconscious. These people catch the hunter and tie him up. They beat him a lot so that he tells, how to treat the poison now. But he does not say anything. Seeing this Octavia also cuts her hand with the same knife, so that like before the hunter saves her again. The hunter does the same. To save her life, he tells her the medicine. And like this, Fink and Octavia, both of them are saved. The mechanic fixed the radio, and informed the people of Ark, that the land has been capable of living. Hearing this, all the people of Ark are very happy. But now a new problem arises on Ark. And that is, that only 1500 people could go to the Earth because the ships were very few. Whereas in Ark, there were more than 2,500 people. The head does not understand anything what to do. But then the old head of Ark, very cleverly, along with her companions, steals all the spaceships of Ark. Locking the head and her people there, she goes to the Earth with her companions. And by doing this, there was an explosion. The spaceships, machines were also damaged. But there was no one to fix the problem. So the old head's companions die. The people of Ark had no way, so they make a plan, that we will make Ark a ship, and will go to the Earth. Because if they stay here, then also, and if Ark cannot be made a ship, then also their death is certain. But still, they decide to take a risk. Finn convinces Ark but she was upset. The mechanic also tries to keep her relationship with Finn. And now Octavia and the hunters also started liking each other. Taking an advantage of this, she frees him. But Finn had already seen them, following Octavia. He reaches the hunter, and offers him the hand of friendship, when the hunter also agrees, and makes them meet his leader. To meet the next day, Clark and the hunter's leader were face to face, because now they were going to live together. But Clark's friend misunderstands, he started shooting at them. In return, the hunters also attack them, and in this way, the enmity between the two groups increases. Now these prisoners started making preparations to fight them, like they start making weapons. They got it luggage in a warehouse so that they can save themselves from the hunter's attack. But the partner of the two guards, is found in a very wounded condition, because the hunters attacked, and put poison in him. Because of the poison, along with him, many other people fall sick. Seeing this, Octavia goes to the hunter, and asks for the cure for this disease. According to him, people get sick from this poison, and do not die, they will be fine on their own in a few days. Octavia comes and tells this to everyone. Hearing this, they feel a little relieved. Clark takes a few of her people, goes to talk to the hunter. We have to build a wall to save ourselves from the other hunters. While my people are sick, the hunter says, that you do this. Destroy the bridge because without it, the hunters will take three days to reach you. They did this, and they blow up the bridge. Due to which some hunters are also killed. They were hungry, and there was nothing to eat. So they go separately and start looking for food by making groups. Clark and Finn are caught by the hunters. Although they try to be free but they can't. The leader of the hunters hears a terrible voice. After which the yellow smoke came. 
So after the departure of the hunters, it turns out that he was the first hunter. Octavia's friend who released them, and starts bringing them back to the camp. On the way, they pass through a cave, where there was another group of strange people. The hunter tells them, that they are human eaters, and they hunt humans. They are called creepers, so that's why we have enmity with them. And now these people had come back to the camp. The mechanic's condition was very bad. She remembers that in the basement, there is a very big oil tank, through which, they can make a big blast. And now these people, start making remotes, so that they can go far away and make this blast. Some people did not want to go out, but the clerk tells them, that we have to leave soon, otherwise the hunters will come and kill us. As soon as everyone leaves from there, then the hunters come there and attack them, from which a very big fight breaks out here. But the prisoners begin to defeat in this. Now seeing them losing, Finn brings the creepers. The creepers come and attack the hunters. The hunters also begin to fight with them to protect themselves. Taking advantage of the fight between the two groups, the prisoners ran away from there and come to a place and hide. By pressing the remote, they make a very big blast, due to which a lot of hunters and creepers are killed. But the head of the hunters was saved. As soon as they came out of that place, there were a lot of people's corpses lying there. These people got scared, but then someone throws a gas bomb on them, and makes them faint. Actually, there was another group on the ground other than them, whose name was Mount Bain. Their strength was that they had the modern weapons. When the Clarks wakes up, she finds herself locked in a room. She comes to the door and sees that her other companions are also trapped here, who were trapped by this new group. They make Ark, the spaceship. But to start it, a person had to stop here. Then the head stops. Ark's people successfully reach the ground safely. They were very happy. After getting the land as before, the season ends with this.